Hello, my name is Victor Eko. In today's video, I will be showing you how to design a flyer for a real estate agency. The size I want to use is flyer, so I will go over to this plus sign and choose flyer. Alright, this is my workspace. So the first thing I'll do is I'll click on this plus sign and go over to grid because I want to import images into it. So I'll scroll over to grid, grid elements. Choosing this first one and I'll crop it a bit like this. I'll click on the plus sign and go back to grid again. This time I'm choosing the one that has three columns. This is it. I do the same thing, I crop it, move it up a bit. Okay. From here now I can go over to photos and to bring in the images. What I'll do is I'll search for homes. If you search for home you see different free version of it. So I'll search for homes. Okay, this is it. So I choose the one I want, I press it down and move it inside the first one. I click on the other icon and say replace. But the one I'm using is um, this one. And I click on the middle icon, the middle frame and replace. I'm using this one. This one is a bit inside so I double tap it to zoom a bit. Tap on the last one and um, which one am I using? Which one should I use? Okay, should I use this? Okay. The next thing I'll do is I'll go to my shape under elements. We'll go over to shapes. Not so bad. Come on. Okay. I choose my shape. I move it here. I reduce it a bit. Then I'm changing the color. I have the color I want to use already. Say four, four, three, a. 9F. That is the color I want to use. I go back to my plus sign again and choose a line. So the line I'm going to make it longer and move it here. Let me use my notch to position it well. I don't want the space to be too much. Okay, good. Good. I change the color to this same color. I duplicate it and move it down a bit. Okay. Next thing, I'll go over to my frame again. Uh, the grid. I'll go over to the grid. Same as I use it here. It should be here. Okay, it's not here. So let me just go to the grid. I'm picking this first one. What I do is I'll crop it again and make it centra centralized. I duplicate this particular shape. I bring it here and I make it join with this one. 
okay for this frame tap it and replace replacing um which which one am i going to use sorry for the sound i'm choosing this particular house good so i have set everything all i need to do okay one more thing before i start adding the text go over to my elements to shape click on see all click on see all i'm choosing this shape that has a round edge and i change it to white reduce this a bit i bring it here and i rotate it like this push it to this place okay good good money man so i put it here sorry i'm at work so just have to do this video click on my plus because i want to start adding text to it and i change this to white and it's here I change the font to Montserrat semi bold semi bold I come over to my format I make it bold and all caps then I can edit it and say comfort I want to reduce this a bit Reduce it small. Comfort. I can duplicate this and say ohms. But the ohms I'm using Britney. I'm choosing Britney for the ohms and making it all small letters. I increase it a bit. Put it here. I group the two together and move it down a bit because I want to add my logo there. I click on my plus sign. I come over to elements. Now, one thing I like about this Canva, I just discovered it yesterday. Under these graphics now, you see, because I'm working on home. Um, that is why it's giving me the different logos that has boom. So this particular one is what I'm choosing. So I don't need to start stressing myself looking for a logo that that will match what I'm doing. So for this, I just change it to white. Then I place it here. I duplicate this and. I change the color to this. I edit it and say price. I make it bold and move it to this point. I can duplicate again, edit it. And go over to dollar. Place it there. I'll come here again. I duplicate to this point. It say about property. 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 So this I'm um, changing it to small letters. Yes, I tried the capital letter. And I don't really like it, so I'm using the small letter. I come to my position and place it to center. Click on this line, duplicate it. Ah, oh, this is very nice now. Huh? I reduce it like this. I place it here. Then can 
let me duplicate the about property again okay I duplicate this since it's here oh. edit it and add any text you want to put okay well, sorry let, let me let me quickly go to my notepad and copy out the dummy text let me just copy this out copy put it here so this is just about your property you will just explain right different things there so I'm aligning to the left let me use my notch to bring it down a bit I go back to notch bring it down okay from here I can copy this one let me duplicate this put it here and say um, special feature special features I'm using small letters for this something like this bring it here position it yeah I'm duplicating again so this is where you just write down um, maybe two bedroom flat duplex and the rest something like this let me copy this out I'm not typing now edit copy so just all you do is just replacing your um, stuff there can I go back to this place I choose the bullets I can reduce it let me increase the spacing a bit okay position it like this um, okay yeah the last thing come over to my shapes again I bring it here I bring the shape down here like this then the color I want to use is um, 3D 3777 yeah and I will add the transparency a bit I'll go over to my elements search for Facebook. I want to I want to bring in the um the logos, the icon I mean. I reduce it like this to so bring it here. You can zoom to see what you are doing. changing this to white and the white to this, this. I click I search for Twitter searching for Twitter Using this, the same thing, change it to white, 
and the white to this and I'm reducing it you have to make everything the same um, the same size come over to here and say Instagram Instagram I'm choosing this change it to white and the same thing as usual you reduce it like this this thing is there um, let me still reduce it a bit Okay, I'm bringing, I want to use some a small letter, so I'm duplicating this to this place, change the color to white, and edit it, and say, add some comfort, comfort zones. like this yeah next thing I'm bringing in my website the websites I've uploaded when I want to use already the same thing you make it the same and I reduce it like this I bring it here then I say can duplicate this and say comforts comforts homes that can yeah all I need to do is I'll reduce this to like um 22 this one also to 22 sorry I'm at I'm at work and people are just talking talking let me use notch to increase this a bit um to shift it a bit uh, Sorry, sorry for that noise you are hearing. I'm almost done. Put this here. Bring this one here. I am currently serving in the north, so I just have to hear their language. Yes, yeah, so this is all about the design. I would love you to do yours and put it. You can tag me at Netflix Services on Instagram. Let me see how you did it. So, thanks for staying to the end of this video. See you later. Bye.